Hello guys, and today I'll be giving you guys a tutorial on how to make an MP command for your Twitch channel. And what uh, this the purpose of this command is, is uh, you might have some viewers asking about, oh, can you give me the download link to the bmap please? And instead of just looking it up, copy pasting it every single time, you can make a short Twitch command like this. Uh, and just uh, directly link the bitmap so they can download it and uh, I'll be showing you guys how to do it so first of all you need to have OSU Stream Companion uh, downloaded and set up already there will be separate videos on YouTube on how to set it up as well as some sort of chatbot for me I downloaded Streamlabs chatbot because I'm already familiar with Streamlabs and stuff uh, but I'm pretty sure it works for other chatbots that you download so don't worry about that but you have to have at least one downloaded and set up there will be uh, obviously YouTube tutorials on how to do this as well and once you have these two downloaded uh, first you gotta make sure when you go on the settings and output patterns uh, make sure to have it as exactly the way that I have it I'm pretty sure this is like the generic or the basic setting uh, the very first thing you see if it's different as this please change it to this I'm pretty sure it's the most simplest way to show a beat map by like this and you can just click save when you're done and you can exit out and now uh, once you're done with that uh, you want to find where your stream companion is located it's most likely going to be in program files x86 and then go into files and then you're going to be seeing these text files you'll be wanting to use mpplayingdl.txt and right now you can see there's nothing in it but if you're playing a song osu it's going to show the beat map right here so but don't worry uh, I'll be showing you how to input it into Streamlabs chatbot right now and first of all it's going to show you the console when you first click it but you want to go into commands and then uh, for people who don't have the command yet you want to do obviously plus add it's for me I already have my setup here so I'll click edit and show you guys now the command you can I put it as MP for now playing but you can put it as whatever you want uh, as long as people know what the command is and you can also put cooldowns on it so like people don't spam it because the one disadvantage about this command is that if someone does exclamation mark MP um, they show you the bitmap uh, link but then Mikuya also reads it too so it should put it as too low people are gonna spam it so just make sure to uh, know what uh, cooldown that you want and in the actions the response is where you're going to be put your command and this is the command that I found that works and obviously this is gonna be different for uh, each person depending uh, where the text file is so just remember where your text file is and just read through this and you can just click on this and it will literally give you the link to it and you can just copy that and then just paste it here the uh, dollar sign read line is probably going to be the same for everybody else and then the parentheses all you need to do is put the put this between the parentheses and then all you need to do is click submit and uh, make sure that this is enabled with a check mark and uh, that's basically it for the command and now I'll be showing you guys a demonstration of how it works so if I go into OSU I put it as Windows so it's a lot easier for me to maneuver so I just play this freedom dive make sure I have no fell on or something so like so let's say I'm just playing the map right now and then somebody was like, oh, I want to know the beat map link. And obviously, I'll be keep on playing it. But even if it's paused, you're basically still in the beat map. So it'll work out. So if I go in here and do exclamation mark MP, like I put in the command, and it'll give you this beat map. And once you click it, boom, it's Freedom Dive Arliss. And to show that it also works with basically almost every other map as long as the map is on the osu website then you're good to go uh, i'll choose like a different artist map like this and then i play it it's like oh this is a new map i also want to download this right 
I just do a score image run MP again. And boom, it's these it's the same map that I'm just playing right now. So like it'll work for pretty sure every map as long as it's on the OSU website. But yeah, that is basically it. Uh, that is how you make the command. If you have any questions, feel free to make sure to put a YouTube comment or a comment on Reddit or whatever. Uh, I'm not an expert on it, but I'll do the very best I can to help you guys out. But that is it guys. Thanks so much for stopping by and watching this video. I hope this helped you a lot. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace.